Hello trappers, it's the middle of September here in the Midwest, Nebraska State. I'd like to say hi to everyone. My name is Shane Clays. I'm the owner of Papio Creek Trapping Supply. I come up with this Magnum Power Clip. I use it extensively for coons and muskrats and I've caught lots of beaver with it. It's very nice clip to be using under the ice for muskrats, but we'll get to that here in a little bit. What I'd like to share with you is how I pile up the coon numbers. Coons runs in, runs in families, and I like to catch as many as I can, when I can, when I set. So what I've got here is a little log on a log pile. This log can be tilted at any angle. This is about the slope that I like. I have a double-headed nail here so that I can go down through thick cottonwood bark, insert the nail, Grab yourself a 220. I like to go through the chain link. Put it where you want to set the log or set the trap. Position the clip, drive it in, make sure it's tight. Move up to the next. I go about two and a half, three foot. Grab yourself a 220, insert it through the chain, it's tight. Now what I also use is a portable screw gun, they're very handy. Get a wood screw. Now we're ready to set traps. You got to get the key. Insert the key into the hole. Make sure both the rubbers, one on each side of the nail head. Squeeze the clip. Adjust the key back and forth until you got the same distance coming out of the hole. Move up to the next one. Do the same thing. Now what them rings are for is sometimes I've had the problem that the key will pop out when the trap goes off. That happens very limited amount of times, but it does happen. These rings will maintain that key in the system. Now let's set some, some traps. I like to maintain that safety until I get it set. What I do is I get it started on the key, come up to the other side of the key, position your trigger and your dog, squeeze the trap together to go to the first notch in the conibear, and we're set. Same thing, position on the key, go over the clip onto the key, squeeze the trap, compressing the clip, setting it to the first trigger, and we're set. Now I'd like to show you the 330. I don't like to set the magnums because they're just too heavy. These are great for beaver underwater with my clip. You can use a pole or a log about this size for the knee deep runs. Again, position 
on the key. Squeeze it. Set it. Now if I was trapping beaver, I would roll this over and drop this. This clip can be turned. It's called a 360 nail. It can be turned to any position, hung upside down in the water. The beaver are going to dive under. But let's get back to the coon. I put some bait up here for the coons. They do run in families. Let's catch as many as we can. I like to set about three kind of bears on a pole on these big log piles. What I'll do is I'll set three at 12 o'clock, three at three o'clock, three at six o'clock, and three at nine o'clock. That way, no matter where they come or go around, they're going to get caught. I use Coon Getter 2 by Papio Creek and also Coon Getter 1. I put a little bait up here. Sometimes I will wipe and wipe, but not a lot. It's an enticer. I don't want coons to try to come up here. What my clip has to offer for everybody out there is the elevation here. We miss a lot of coons with the clip systems that are out there because coons will climb over. I don't want them to climb over. I want them to walk through. So, with that said, the first coon comes up, trying to get to the wipe or the bait. He comes up. He's caught. He's hanging there. The next one's going to come up. He gets caught. He's hanging there. Then we go to the big guy, and he gets caught, and he's hanging there. Now it's time to get out there, guys, gals. Price is going up. There's a lot of coons out there, and a lot of people want you to get them. Get out there and ask permission. I leave these clips on year-round. I take the keys home, but I leave the clips on the logs. Some of you might not want to do that. A bar or a hammer can be removed or the screw. I wish you the best of luck, folks. Give Magnum Power Clips a try. If you have any questions, feel free to go to my website. I wish you the best of luck and thank you.